This is a really late start to my vlog. It's 5.45. It's already dark outside. But here we go. My name is Philip. Here's my show. Alright, so today I got a haircut. Um, I was actually meant to record earlier um, for the video. I watched a game earlier too, a football game, Portugal against France. Portugal lost. Don't want to talk about it. Um, I think that's why I didn't film earlier on when I should have, or when I usually do. So me filming at a different time of day and doing a different strategy for a video kind of fits into what I want to talk about a bit. I want to talk about impermanence and fleeting moments because I've been talking about this a lot with my friend David and my brother Luke and uh, it's just yeah, it's an interesting topic another topic I'm gonna just talk about it briefly before we talk about that topic I'm just gonna record a little bit guitar <laughs> Okay, recording is done now. I gotta edit that, but I'm not gonna edit today. I'm gonna be eating in like 15, 20 minutes and then watching a movie afterwards and maybe playing Call of Duty. I'm chilling out. It's Saturday. Yeah, it's Saturday. I've been. This year I've learned to, to like chill a lot more than I used to. Anyways, but that's not the topic of this video. Let's talk about fleeting moments. So when I say fleeting moments, Everything in life has an end to it, right? And that's and that's just the truth. Like plants die, people die, relationships die, an idea dies. And obviously these things still carry energy and have a power to them. It's not like it's just a depressing end. Like there's a purpose for them. But the fact of the matter is that life is a fleeting moment with any perspective you have with it. So it could be a year, it could be a hundred years, it could be a hundred million years. Like it still doesn't last forever. It's a fleeting moment. Although fleeting moment makes it sound like it's a short moment, but, but life is a fleeting moment. It's easy to be sad about a statement like that, but that's life wouldn't be any fun if it lasts forever. And I think we genuinely believe that we want peace forever but you know that if you had peace for one year it wouldn't be peace anymore because it wouldn't mean anything you wouldn't have anything to compare it to maybe i'm going on a tangent right now but the through line the the main point of what i'm trying to say is that because things don't last forever they are special in any form any shape or form a bad time is special because it doesn't last long a good time is special because it doesn't last long and that's why the good times feel so good and we should stop, we, I, should stop viewing things as like, oh no, that's ending, like, or oh no, when I get this, it's not going to last that long, or oh no, loved ones are going to die, stuff like that. It's like, obviously, yes, it's devastating and sad, but like, man, that's the beauty of the life we live. It's shit's temporary. That's why we value it so much, or we should value it. And uh, yeah, that's just my thought. That's, I think that's, I've hit that home. I think that's all I wanted to say. I actually forgot the reason why I started this video with this topic was because I don't usually start filming this late. And with this mindset of maybe I was in a space and in, in a grind where I, I wake up early and I do this routine of filming like this and like this. And that's just, it was a certain time and space, but things change and not getting attached to the way I was doing things because the, the the times in life you hurt the most is when you just like attach to something it's like oh no it has to be this way um which is actually a reference to the next song that I have coming out soon yeah so I'm just embodying whatever's coming at me the best I can in music and video and business relationships like I know what I want and I'm pretty direct with it 
but then if it's not happening or if it's not right, then adjust quickly and understand the situation. You might be wondering what that food was. It was chicken that was burnt. I'm talking to the camera. It was chicken that was uh, burnt and destroyed by the oven. I'm going to watch Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. If you haven't watched this animated movie, watch it. It's very good if you like superhero movies, obviously. Um, I don't only watch Spider-Man movies. Last time I was watching Spider-Man again. but uh, yeah, I'm going to watch it with my brother. That's it. Maybe a more exciting maybe a more exciting video next time. No, this was good this was an exciting video. I'm not gonna say that. It's bad to do that to yourself. Alright, have a good day, have a good night. I'll see you all soon.